guys welcome back today i'm gonna be doing a top six best vanilla fragrances according to me you know i see a lot of lists where people say you know this is the best vanilla fragrance and then scent itself is maybe more on the floral side on the fruity side you know something else and it's not really a vanilla just because the vanilla note is in there doesn't mean that the fragrance is actually vanillic and i was always looking for that true vanilla scent that smelled kind of gourmandish um you know kind of edible sweet maybe a little powdery and so whatever i have here today is definitely it in my opinion the vanilla is definitely prominent in these fragrances and these are like my top top vanilla fragrances that i would I think I would always have in my perfume collection. This is what I always wear. These are my favorites and they always make me feel better if I am not in a good mood <laughs> just because they smell great, you know? So if you're interested to see my list, please keep on watching. I wanted to give a quick shout out to Mommy Silk. They sent me this beautiful pink robe. You guys, their colors are absolutely gorgeous. I have worked with Mommy Silk before and I also have PJs from them in this beautiful um, blue color. I'm going to insert a picture somewhere here. I also have pillowcases from this brand which look like this. Just look at this beautiful, beautiful pink color. I really hope that the camera shows the true color because in real life, it's just gorgeous. It's stunning. And oh my God, you guys, it is so, so soft. All of their products are 100% silk, they're high quality, and if you iron it, it looks even more beautiful. So definitely do not forget to iron your products once you receive them. Just wanted to show up close the way the material looks like. You guys, it is so, so soft. It's crazy, crazy soft. It feels so nice on the skin. It cools you down and silk is just great for your skin and the hair you know sometimes when you wake up in the morning you have like li lines on your cheeks or like on your forehead that's from the fabric that you sleep on it kind of you know pulls and tags on your skin and then you get like wrinkles and if you're gonna keep getting those lines on your face eventually they will become wrinkles which i'm pretty sure you do not want um silk does not do that it doesn't pull on your skin or anything like that it's very gentle and soft and it just keeps your pillow cool all the time which is good for your sleep you know you, know you fall asleep faster that way when you're pillow school at least I like it that way and then for the hair it's also really good especially if you struggle with hair loss and things like that like I also have cotton sheets and I also have a bunch of hair on my pillow every every morning that I wake up which is horrible I do also struggle with hair loss um so silk definitely does not do that it's perfect for your hair and your skin and you guys i highly highly recommend this brand their products are really high quality and i absolutely love them you can get a discount for 15 percent if you use my coupon code which i'm going to put in the description box and up here as well it's natalie 15 so yeah thank you mommy silk for sending me these products Okay, so the first fragrance that I have here, I think is always going to be number one in my, I wouldn't say in my perfume collection, but it's definitely going to be a number one vanilla scent. You know, I, I tried a lot of vanilla fragrances and I actually discovered a few new ones recently, which I absolutely love. They became my favorites uh, real fast, but this is, I think, always going to be number one. This is called Sweet Vanilla from Mantal. I'm pretty sure that you guys know about Mantal fragrances. They are crazy potent. They have a great performance, great sillage. They last all day long. And this is definitely one of them. So this fragrance only has two notes as far as I know. And that's definitely what I smell in here. It's just plain and simple. It's vanilla and it's apricots. Very juicy, sweet apricots. 
But the thing is, the vanilla in here, it does smell gourmand. It smells very edible. And every time I spray this, I kind of want to like lick the spot where I sprayed it. Just because it smells so good and so realistic. It smells just a little bit powdery. Just like, um, like a powdery vanilla that you put in uh, cakes or whatever things like that and then definitely definitely you can smell the juicy apricots you guys i every time i wear this i get compliments i swear it has a crazy sillage it lasts all day long on the skin all you need is like one spray and you will definitely have a good projection this is going to live on your clothes forever and ever until you actually wash them. So you definitely get what you pay for. And this is definitely one of my favorites. I've been talking about this fragrance for years now. And I'm pretty sure if you watch my channel, you have seen this perfume in my videos. But yeah, this is definitely unisex. So I think that just because this is vanilla and it's sweet, it probably smells feminine no this is definitely unisex it smells great on a man and it definitely smells great on a woman so i highly highly recommend to try this one out if you're looking for a great vanilla scent because i feel like this is definitely underrated i don't hear people talking about this fragrance uh, especially on youtube so yeah sweet vanilla from mantel the next one of course is definitely a Grimont and it is La Stanza Delle Labellule from Nobel 1942 which translates as the Dragonfly Dance. You guys, this smells so so good. Like I just want to eat this. This is definitely like a powdery vanilla with a little bit of cinnamon to it. This cinnamon is very very subtle in here. It does not smell like spicy or anything like that whatsoever at least to me it is a gorgeous vanilla scent with some apple in here as far as i remember um it says that there is red apple in here but i smell a green apple that's a little bit sour and it kind of also smells like an apple strudel or an apple pie definitely definitely gorgeous and i try to kind of save this fragrance up uh, the performance is not the best with this one, unfortunately. This is more of like a more of a skin scent, so it does sit kind of close to the skin. So yeah, it doesn't last that long, in my opinion. In cooler weather, it definitely lasts for around six at six seven hours. Um, but in the warm weather, it doesn't last that long. So I definitely have to reapply. And I hate reapplying my fragrances because, you know, I don't want to use them up. I want to have my babies all the time. And I don't like to repurchase the same fragrances. So, yeah. So this is how much I use from here. Uh, you, prob you probably have seen this on my channel as well because I, I have been talking about this for years as well. So, yeah, if you're looking for that, true vanilla gourmand scent this is gonna be definitely it another one from mantal here is called vanilla cake i feel like this is also underrated this fragrance oh my god to me it smells like the most realistic vanilla cake it smells like whipped cream sugar perhaps like um chocolate chips on that whipped cream and that sugar and definitely an almond note in here it's that um roasted almond it it doesn't smell like italica from zarjav or anything like that the almond in here is definitely in well at least in my opinion is very realistic roasted almond that's what i smell in here and it smells so yummy it smells again edible gourmand if you're looking for that very like sexy tasty scent this is gonna be it this also gets compliments people ask me every time what i am wearing however the performance even though this is mental the performance in my in my opinion is not um that great as uh sweet vanilla from mental like this is a beast this one is not i feel like i have to reapply this and this lasts around three four hours on my skin and then I do smell this on my clothes but i feel like it also not that strong like it sits very very close to the fabric so yeah unfortunately the performance is not the best in my opinion 
um so i do have to reapply this however the scent is absolutely amazing very very yummy smelling and i don't know why people don't really talk about this fragrance on youtube which i feel is also underrated so yeah definitely definitely try vanilla cake from manta and then the next fragrance that i have here is new in my collection i have reviewed this house on my channel i'm gonna link it up here you can check it out but you guys this is called van ecstasy x from lorenzo Battaglia. this is an italian niche house oh my god you guys this vanilla is just like on another level i swear so in here the notes are pretty simple there's just like a bunch of vanilla in here it seems like they just took all the vanillas that exist out there and put it in this bottle and then they put white florals in here caramel and oud now let me tell you something this vanilla might smell kind of simple in the opening it's just gonna smell kind of sugary and sweet and you might think like oh okay so you know it's just like a sugary vanilla however once it starts opening it is just it's it's gorgeous <laughs> the oud definitely comes out in here at least i can smell it some people say they can't smell it i can and i don't smell the white florals in here whatsoever i smell the caramel in here a sugary kind of powdery vanilla and some oud the oud in my opinion is what makes their, this fragrance stand out it's definitely given it uniqueness i haven't smelled anything like this before like i said you might think that this smells kind of sugary and simple in the opening but don't be fooled by that it is it definitely has depth to it it's kind of complex in my opinion definitely gorgeous fragrance this is by the way extra de parfum it is very oily i think there is 40 percent of oil concentration in here the bottles are gorgeous as well definitely check out um, the video where i review all of these fragrances and then i have a sample also from this house which is called van pie ron it's also from lorenzo Italia. this fragrance is a very very popular from this house and um, this is also a vanilla fragrance now you guys this fragrance this one and um van ecstasy x are the best the best ever so these are like my top three right now like just simple vanilla perfumes that smell like vanilla and tasty and edible that's sweet vanilla van ecstasy x and van pyrom well, van pyrom kind of smells like van ecstasy but it has like a twist to it so there's also oud in here uh, I don't remember if there's white florals in here. I don't think there's caramel in here. There's vanilla in here, oud. Uh, there's rum in here and there's patchouli in here. You can definitely smell the rum and the patchouli. It kind of smells bitter in the opening because of that rum. And then the patchouli kicks in right away. And it smells a little bit earthy. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention there's oud in here. And so this is definitely more of a complex vanilla. It definitely smells kind of strong in the opening. However, once it starts to settle down and it, you know, opens up, it becomes more sugary in my opinion than Van Ecstasy. Like Van Ecstasy, I feel like this is more on the caramel vanilla oud side. This one is more on like a very sugary vanilla like every time i smell this i just picture white sugar you know when you like pour white sugar in a cup and it's just it's powdery and you can actually smell it like it's it smells sweet it's like a sweet powder this is what i smell in here with vanilla so yeah it definitely smells vanillic sugary and you can definitely smell that patchouli the patchouli does not go away and i feel like the patchouli also give it a great lasting power it lasts very very long especially on the clothes and it has a great projection great sillage and definitely a compliment getter whoever i let this smell everyone said wow this definitely smells different and they just want to keep sniffing their arm or like the spot where they sprayed it you know so 
I definitely need this in my collection. I will be purchasing this fragrance. I couldn't decide before, do I get Van Ecstasy X? Do I get Van Pyrom? And then once I got Van Ecstasy X, I was like, you know what? I definitely, definitely need Van Pyrom because even though they kind of smell similar, um, they actually don't smell similar. Like once you smell them side by side, there is a difference and that patchouli and the rum are definitely sticking out in here. So yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Great unisex, by the way, uh, Van Pyrum and Van Ecstasy X. Anybody can wear it. It smells great on a guy and on a woman. So you guys definitely check this fragrance out. And then I have the last fragrance here, which is also a vanilla. This is a salty vanilla. And this is called Blue Turquoise from Armani Privé. I have talked about this fragrance a few times on my channel. And this is definitely very, very unique in my collection. Because this is a salty vanilla. But this vanilla kind of smells like the ocean, the seashells, um, the breeze from the ocean. It kind of smells like the spa. I also kind of smell like salty rocks from the ocean in here it's just a very very unique vanilla i also haven't smelled anything like this before there is vanilla vibes from uh, juliet has it done which is kind of from the same family but that one smells more medicinal to me for some reason there's something in there that's given me like medicinal vibes in here, this is definitely smells more like therapeutic, relaxing, vacation-like, ocean, like I said, the spa. It's like you're getting a massage somewhere on a vacation and they're using all these lotions and sprays and this is what it smells like. Absolutely gorgeous. I don't know if this is discontinued. Um, there was some time where I couldn't find this online. It was sold out. Somebody said it was discontinued and then I saw this in the stores again. So I'm not even really sure. Uh, I'm going to check it out online, see if there's links um, that I can link so you guys could purchase this. But if you if you a vanilla lover like me, you definitely need this in your collection, 100%. By the way, this lasts all day long, one to two sprays and like you're good to go. I also feel like this is great for summertime just because I said it smells like um, the ocean and all that stuff. It smells salty. But the thing is, this also smells very luxurious and like sophisticated. So I can actually picture, you know, somebody wearing like a suit, going to a business meeting and wearing this. Definitely, definitely a compliment getter lasts all day long and has a great projection and sillage as well okay you guys this was the last fragrance thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it definitely check out mummy silk their products are gorgeous and the coupon code is gonna be down below and i'll see you in my next video